Today we're going to look at configuring the QoS priority control for the Buffalo Air Station WZR1750 DHP as well as the WZR1166 routers. First thing you want to do is go to the admin interface of your router. So if you want to navigate to the IP address in the browser and then the default username is admin, default password is password. You'll notice at the bottom left of your tile sets will have the QoS area, so we'll just click on that one. What we're going to do is select video and you can select apply and what this is going to do is if you have five computers in the house or even just using your only one computer and you're to start downloading a bunch of files but you go to YouTube or Netflix and you decide you want to watch a video it's going to limit the downloads and you'll notice here it's going to slim down what my download bandwidth usage can be but it's going to keep as much video bandwidth as it can so that way the video takes control. So what you can do, you could also do it for gaming. So if you were to select gaming, maybe you have uh, your FPS games or an MMO or something that's going to, you want all of the bandwidth you can get for it so that way there's, uh, there's less issues, then you would select gaming. It's going to make sure that it gets all control so that way if something if somebody started browsing or downloading files it'll make sure it has enough for gaming to keep what it's going to do and give the leftovers to download uh, you also have voice which is going to be things such as Skype or Google Chat or FaceTime and then we can also set custom apply to that one custom is going to be a policy that we have to go set in the advanced settings so this is just going to select whatever the custom policy currently is to use that to set the custom policy, we click on the gears, which are at the top right, and then you'll notice here it's got the priority control QoS settings. This area, if you're using the AdBlock or AdBlock Plus add-ins for Chrome or Firefox, it, uh, we have seen it have an issue where it just shows up as all white, and so your options don't look like they're present. If you whitelist this page, uh, which in AdBlock you can click the little add block icon and uncheck the box to block this page then refresh the page it'll then load all these settings for you now what we want to do here is we're going to be manually setting our settings you'll see here we have ultra premium 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 uh, with lower latency and above average standard in junk and what this means is let's say we set our download to junk it doesn't mean that download is always going to be bad. However, if you're downloading files and then somebody decides to, to go gaming or watching a video or, or something of that nature, then it's going to try to give as much bandwidth for the other services and it's always going to just limit the downloads to whatever the leftovers are of everything else. So you kind of want to set these to, hey, if I make a conference call, odds are I want that to be the highest thing. I want to make sure I have enough for the conference call. It's not Conference calls don't take up too much bandwidth, so in that, in that setting it's not really going to affect too much of your other services, but we want to make sure that if somebody's watching a video that my conference call doesn't suffer just because they're, they're watching a video. So we might set that to a, a premium but keep this ultra premium, make sure all my gaming is, is proper, and then we can kind of lower it, lower the settings down, and browsing, you know, it's not really going to need too much, just whatever whatever's available and download. So once these settings are set in this way, then I'm going to select enable for this, and apply, which is at the bottom right. So this is now going to prioritize my settings custom based on what I have. One of the things that you can do is you can go into your devices area and take a look to find out what what is actually using the bandwidth. So if you were to go into your devices, we'll notice here we're going to select, uh, we'll see my PC, and you'll notice the one that you're administering your router on will have the green icon. So I am going to go to YouTube and we'll take a look at a video and I'm going to use up a bunch of bandwidth. I'm going to load it 1080p and then you can select the second icon which will now show throughput. So you'll see I'm downloading, I'm using about 8.3 megabits of my bandwidth. 
and there's another one so it's going to use it's just going to show you about a three second average of how much is getting used for whatever you're doing so pulling down a, a YouTube video is going to it's going to buffer a bunch and then it's going to settle down a little bit and then it's going to keep a continuous stream going so we'll see here how much bandwidth we're using and if I were to close this window and that's all you have to do for QoS so once you have that set you can let it go uh, if there's anything else let us know in the comments